you are. Yes. Here I am. Something wrong? I don't suppose you have any idea how another 50 quid happened to go missing from my account today? How should I know? What do you take me for, Janine? No, I'm sorry. I really don't know what you're talking about. Oh, I think you do. I saw you today stealing my money with my wife's cash card. And you know something? I suddenly figured out where that other 1,500 quid of mine has gone. Well, I only borrowed it. <laughs> you borrowed it? Yeah. Well, it was when you went away. I was depressed. I was lonely. If you hadn't have left me here on my own, it would never have even crossed my mind. Oh, it's my fault now. Yeah, I was bored out of my brains. I just wanted to cheer myself up a bit with a few nice things, that's all. Look, I've got it back. I was going to put it straight into your bank account tomorrow and you'd never have even known. No, I'm really sorry, but please take it. I want to pay you back. Where did you get this? I won it. On the horses. Well, that's why I had to take out the extra 50. You've got to speculate in order to accumulate, you see? First, you steal my money, then you let me think my wife has come back. I mean, what do you think you're trying to do to me? So what are you going to do? Throw me out again? You have not got a clue what I've been going through here, worrying about how I was going to pay you back. All that money, can you imagine what it's been like for me? You really are something else, aren't you? No, you've got to start seeing things from other people's point of view, Terry. Otherwise, you're going to end up a very sad and lonely old man. Anyway, I'm starving. I'm going to go and get myself some chips. <laughs>